Welcome to the Pretty and Profiting Show, your favorite show for branding, beauty, business, and the truth of how to be a boss lady and build your empire. Pause the show right now and grab your seat at prettyprofitsgift.com and enroll into the free 21-day e-course to build a brand that people crush on, gossip about, and buy from. And now, your host. She is the fierce money-making brand strategist and creative freaking genius, Nicole K. Lundy. Hey, my fabulous, pretty and profiting posse peeps. As you know, it's February and we are talking, we have a whole month where we're talking about creating brand love for your business. Today, pretty provocative topic, but it's to get your attention and it's to get you moving and to get people to fall in love with your brand. We're talking about how to get intimate with your prospects. Intimate meaning first date, well, let me rephrase that. First base, second base, and then third base. That's what needs to happen. So first base whether that's dating or making out, this is the equivalent to you proving yourself, proving how awesome, proving how brilliant, proving that you are an expert and not just expert, a leading authority in your industry. So I know I'm beating the hell, I was gonna say another word, But I'm beating the crap out of you have to talk about your expertise. You have to share content. Content marketing is critical. You have to train. You have to speak. You have to have a strategy in place. Now, I'm not saying you have to do all of those things, but you need to have one to two in place at least where you are showing your market, showing the world that you are a leading authority in this particular area. That's the fondling part. It's like, I have a crush on you. Do you have a crush on me? Yes, I'm cute. Do you think I'm, I think you're cute too. It's that, it's that discovery phase. Think about like when you were a teenager and you had your first crush. It's that discovery phase. Is he thinking about me? Should I write this note? Do you like me? And you have a, you know, a box that says yes or no. That's what your marketing does for you. And content marketing gets you there faster, gets you to your yes or no faster. One, it helps you as the CEO of your business, know who's your target audience because you always need to refine that process. On the flip side, if you are a person looking for an accountant, a lawyer, a brand strategist, whatever it is you do, you simply, you know, you got that note in your desk of, do you like me? Yes or no. And you can click yes or no with certainty. So if you know the target audience that you're going after is constantly, repeatedly checking, no, I don't like you, you need to go after a different target audience. Fondling, fondling, you have to fondle and get under the shirt of your prospects. Ask them, do you like me? Do you want to go on a first date? So that's first base. Second base is having a low cost, low risk opportunity for people to test you out. A lot of times this comes in the form of a telesummit where you are hosting it, you upsell either working with you or having a, you know, 30 minutes with you. This is you speaking at an event and people getting a chance to ask you a Q&A after your your fabulous talk. This is you having a 27, 47, $97 training, whether it's a three-day, you know, intensive on something that people can enroll in before they spend thousands of dollars with you. That is your low cost entry. This is your first date. Test me out. I'll take you, you know, to this fancy restaurant or I'll take you to Taco Bell. But test me out and see what you think. This can only happen after the fondling phase, after the first base has happened. Because 
Nobody's going to say yes to go on a date with you and spend, you know, a few hours of their life if they if they don't have some curiosity or some level of interest in you, in your brand. It's the same concept. Third base. This is when you're doing the do. All clothes are off, you know, you're getting into it. This is when people are working with you. This is when they are 100% sure that you are the solution they need to move forward in their business, in their life, in their health, in their relationship, whatever it is that your business offers. This is where you want to get to in your business. It's important. And brand experience comes into this place because you need to make sure your customers are 100% satisfied. They need to have orgasmic feelings and experiences and and results from working with you. Third base. We'll be right back. We're talking about getting intimate with your prospects in this fabulous month that we're talking about brand love. We'll be right back. It's time to get bold and get your brand out there in a big, smart way. If you want more clients, a waiting list, in fact, the exact tools to make more money with your programs, to become the celebrity in your marketplace, generate more business opportunities to showcase your expertise, a zealous community of people in your tribe, and to make more money, I created the Monetize My Brand program to do exactly that for your business. Listen, the world is hungry for real, authentic brands that not only transforms their life, but impacts generations to come. Go to prettyprofits2015.com today and enroll. So we're back. We're talking brand love this month. Today, we're talking about you getting intimate with your prospects, moving from first base to second base to third base, where you are delivering the goods over and over again and your customers cannot get enough of you. That's third base. First base, it's all about the fondling. It's all about showing people. Think of like a rooster or like one of those animals in the wild that, you know, the males have the fabulous colors because they're attracting the females. Same concept. So, Before we go, I want to talk to you about McDonald's because McDonald's is not selling, you know, that mysterious, you know, McChicken sandwich. They're selling happiness and they go from first to third base real quick. Like Drake said, zero to 100 because they understand who their target audience is. I am not... McDonald's idol target audience and it may be because I worked there in college which is another completely different story but they're not selling sandwiches they're not just selling their shoestring fries they are selling emotions that is the point I want to drive to you to get from first base to third base with your prospects where they are pl- they are paying loyal clients, they want to spend thousands of dollars with you, hundreds of thousands of dollars with you, you have to get intimate with them. Don't be afraid, get intimate. And the only way you can get intimate with them is if you mutually, if there's a mutual relationship of you love this group of people who are your target audience and they love you. There is nothing worse than getting in bed with somebody that you have zero attraction for. They're not just getting in bed with you, you're getting in bed with them. Get intimate, y'all. This is your host, Nicole K. Lundy. We'll talk very soon. Thank you for tuning into this episode of the Pretty and Profiting Show. Now, I want you to join the Pretty and Profiting Posse over on Facebook. It's simple to join. Just go to Facebook, type in Pretty and Profiting in the search box and click join. Hurry, we're waiting on you. Until next time, stay pretty and stack those profits.